Welcome back to Fat and Tactical. Today we're out here. Uh, we are going to shoot some plumber's putty. If you're asking why plumber's putty, I have a history in working construction and I worked with a lot of stuff and plumber's putty was the cheapest one I could afford. Here we are. Let's, uh, let's go check out and see what we got. All right, so what we got set up here is we got uh, five pound pails of plumber's putty. So we got two, four, six, eight. So we got 40 pounds. We are gonna see if this 40 pounds of plumber putty will stop a bullet. Alrighty, so first up we got 22 long rifle. Like I said, as per usual. Start out small, go from there. Aha, hit it. Let's see what we got. We hit a little bit left. Let's see if we made it through. Nope. All right, so this seems promising. If you're in a hardware store, hide behind the putty from 22 long rifle. Let's move it up to nine millimeter. Took the lid off the first one to see if I could find the bullet. And guess what? Right there on top. Actual mushroomed out pretty good. It looks like a little mushroom. We caught one. Let's see if we can catch a nine millimeter next. All right, so next up, we got Glock 17, nine millimeter, and I have a full metal jacket on top first. Then we got a hollow point on the bottom. I'm gonna try to aim a little bit lower and see if we can get it more in the middle instead of on top. Here we go. Ha! Putty went flying everywhere. I swear I got some on me. That was the full metal jacket. Now we're going to go for the hollow point. Yep, putty went flying everywhere. Let's go see what we got. So, per typical Glock, we went left, but we still hit it, so let's see what we got. Absolutely destroyed the first one. We came into the second one. I'm going to pull that putty out, see if I can find the bullet. We didn't get lucky enough to find the bullet, but we're going to move on to 45 ACP. Alrighty, so up next we got the 1911. Um... Once I eventually get a little bit better started, we can feature more different weapons instead of the same old ones. Got plenty of nine millimeter, same caliber, different guns, so you're not seeing the same thing all the time. So, like I said, 1911, and we got 230 grain FMJs. Here we go. Ha ha. All righty. Gonna go right about. Let's go right there. Yep. Putty flew everywhere again. All right. Here we go. Ha ha. Let's see what we got. All righty. So it seems like I'm pulling my shots left, but let's see what we got. Came in here. Put a pretty good tunnel through there. And... Looks like we came in right here, and we shot out the side. So, shot out the side, and skin this, this one here. Let's move on to rifle calibers. Up first is going to be 5.56. Five, five, All righty, so up first, we got the Diamondback DB-15 again with full metal jacket 5.56. Five, here we go. My favorite sound in the whole world. Aha! Let's go see what we got. Alrighty, as you've seen, I blew this thing to smithereens. It looks like it just went out the side. Oh yeah. Hit that one. It hit that one and went out the side. So, up next, 300 blackout. It's not stopping bullets. Well, it stopped 22, but it's diverting them. So, you'd be mostly safe. All right, so next up, 300 blackout pistol. <clears throat> and I have these weird hollow point-esque target rounds. Here we go. Ha ha. Ha 
I'll get it one of these shots. Alright, so looks like we went low. And we, yeah, we definitely came out the bottom. Set. Piece of the jacket. Nope, just burn mark. So I'm under the assumption that I need to be a better shot. And for the grand finale, we got Mount Plumber's Putty. Hopefully, 308 will stop. If not, I got more. Alrighty, so up next we got the new 308 with full metal jackets. Send her home. Ha. Alrighty. Here we go. In three, two, one. Well, I don't think that stopped. Let's go take a look. Alrighty, so walking up to this, we made a mess. Putty everywhere. But right off the bat, We stopped the 308. How about that? Check that out. Pretty neat. So, in conclusion, I will say, Plumber's Putty will save your life if you're in a hardware store. To my conclusion, Plumber's Putty will stop bullets, so yay for that. Let me know in the comments below if you made it this far. Thank you very much. But let me know in the comments below what else do you want to see or what do you want to see next. Please hit that like and subscribe button and we will catch you on the next one.